This is McCook's Mr. Bilson, honored to have you here. This last week, a young lady, first year in college, back in New York State, a block away from her college, was attacked. Attacked, mind you, by three youths. One of them was just 13. She didn't have any money with her, and they were demanding money. How did they pay her back since they couldn't get money? They stabbed her to death. They killed that young woman. So my question to you and to your loved ones is $50, give or take, worth the next 50 years of your life. Because very few people are accosted more than once or twice in their entire lifetime. And if you can get by that attack, that time, the rest of your life you get to live and enjoy life on earth and your family and your friends. But that one time when you have no backup of other people, you're on your own on that day that you're attacked, how easy would it have been and how cheap it would have been to have $50 in your pocket, $50 give or take, in your pocket. That's a dollar a year for the next 50 years that you get to live when somebody demands money from you. Forget about the right and the wrong. It's who's left after the attack or after the attempted robbery or robbery. Who is left? $50 in your pocket or in your kid's pocket might just make the difference between life and death. Might just make the difference. And I bet the family of that killed and murdered daughter I bet they would have gladly given 50 and many times that if she could have been alive. And all she had to do was carry some money to buy her a good chance of survival. That does not mean that those three ignorant, stupid people, those ignorant, stupid people that attacked her, those three young people, young men, they were black, they attacked her. They attacked that innocent woman. And she didn't have a plan B, like the money. She didn't have a plan C. And I believe, permanently, I strongly believe that every woman should carry pepper spray. For less than one and a half ounces, mind you, less than one and a half ounces, you can protect yourself with pepper spray gives you a lot of advantage. The FBI says it. They said that if every woman in America, adult woman, would carry pepper spray, they could stop 70% of the rapes in America if they just had pepper spray. How important is it? And for less than $10 and less than an ounce and a half in your pocket, in your purse, if you had it with you, absolutely with you. But not just that though, because maybe, just maybe, they can come on in after you've sprayed them. And so, you need some other tools. I like tactical pen, or I like this little bad boy, if you can see it. I don't know how well that'll show up. And it's got the two spikes. Your fingers can go right in there. And that is like driving two nails into somebody. Absolutely. Or you can drive down this way. And you don't throw for the chest or the body or the head. No. When they're out there trying to grab you or hit you or stab you, you go for their hands with the spikes of these or this and just disable the hand and now you're fighting a one-armed man. A one-armed man and with the pepper spray, you're fighting a one-armed blind man. I want to keep you safe. I want to stop crime and law enforcement and the billions of dollars that we spend every year on law enforcement is not going to stop crime. They'll only go after them after the crime. It's up to you to be your front line battle hardened troops. You have to be your own police, your own army, your own defender. And women are more susceptible, elderly, but anybody can be attacked. The first and the cheapest way to do it to live so that you can have another 50 years on life is just throw them some money and let them go on down the road and be thankful that you didn't get hurt. And if they come on in and want a war, you've got the pepper spray to blind them and you've got some other kind of defense. That doesn't work for a firearm, but 95% of the people that attack you do not have a firearm. 
they have a knife or a club or something in that nature. This gives you a good or a better than even chance of surviving the attack. 